Artists come a dime a dozen, but every once in a while you're able to come across one with work so good it looks like it jumps off the canvas. Well, Katia Baskin is one of those rare individuals who's making her rise in the art community. Um, well, this this right here is um, kind of a new thing I'm doing. Um, I'm going more towards fantasy. Um, this is the first piece to um, the Four Seasons, and I'm going to have four frames. These are actual mirror frames uh, with the mirrors taken out, and I'm just painting straight on the backing. Um, and I'm going to paint, this is fall. And then the next one's gonna be summer, winter, spring. Katia is an independent artist and a full-time art teacher. She also volunteers at the local studio, Gallery 788. There she gets a chance to display her work and fine-tune her style. Power and like freedom, that's to me, like they're very expressive and bright. In the way I mix my colors, there's not a lot too much blending, but it still goes together and I feel like my paintings just jump out more at people than a lot of stuff that's maybe more blended or visually pleasing. Um, I want them to be visually pleasing, but I also want them to grab people's attention. And uh, that's why people, faces, figures, I think, grab people's attention and make people look at them. As of right now, the main motivation behind the art is women. She aimed to create females as elegant, sophisticated, and powerful. To her, those are the attributes of women that makes them special. A lot of people ask me why it's all women, um, and I, I guess it's the availability of the subjects, and that's just I, the female form is more good looking than male to me. and. Um, I guess it's part of it is I try, I put a lot of myself in them um, and I just try and show the woman powerful and beautiful and you know fragile at the same time and mis there's a lot of mystery in a lot of my paintings I think and uh, I guess a lot of them kind of express a little bit of me, a lot of, pe a lot of them even though they are not of me um, but people say some of them look like me. I guess that's just kind of subconscious. Her work can be seen all over the city, especially at Gallery 788. Her paintings of proud women hang there for all to appreciate. So if you get a chance, stop by. You might even catch her making her next masterpiece.